Okay, I'm here to wait. Let me see. Uh, is this thing even recording? Oh yeah, it's recording. Okay, I'm here to to show you how to download, how to set up the Miku Miku Dance or MMD for short. The it's just like a puppeteering programming model, and it's pretty fun to use if you know what you're doing. But tutorial, that's going to be a different story. Just look around on YouTube. I know you'll find some. Uh, for here, I'm going to show you how to do your setup, where to download, and also there's been some troubleshot because there's something about with Windows 7, it might work, but with Windows 8, it won't work for shit. As you can see here, yeah, I have a Windows 8 computer, as you can see here. And I figure out a way to make your MMD model work. As you see, mine's already here. And as you see, run administrator. That's what I like to do because I have no idea. It works faster or whatever. You see? Load up any model you like. I'll just go with her, the most common one. Yeah, I know that. And boom, see? Mine's work like a charm. But the thing is, beforehand, I had some trouble with it because it won't let me do anything. Won't let me open the application in the first place. And that's why I'm here to teach you how to do it. Alright, let's see. First, you go to your web browser, whatever you like. Google. Go to YouTube. And usually, just put MMD, MMD download. And should to find a video. And it shows you this link, as you see here. Uh, don't worry, I'll make it a lot more easier for you guys. I'll just give you the link. And then you go down to here. Around these two, these two are the latest within the MMD programming, the latest update. So just simply click. Ah, oh shit, I wonder why my mouse acting funny. You click, and it shows right here. It's downloading. Sorry about this little black bar. It's really getting annoying here. And it should finish, yeah. It finished now. And then you just simply just... No, nah, better idea, don't just open it. Just go to your downloads right here. And you should be able to find it right here. It's pretty easy enough. You just need a right click and extract all. Let's see, extract wherever you'd like it either in your oh yeah I already have it so I'm just gonna skip it I already have it downloaded first I'm gonna I already have it as you saw earlier and here it is same here but as you try to open the program it won't let you because you need to download the DirectX 9 or something like that. And uh, let's see. I also will give you the link. Well, it gives you here too, right around here. DirectX and user runner time. But I'll give you the link to make it easier for you. Or you can just click it back there because it just directly gives you the link right here. And this will load up. Just simply press the download. Oh, I just put uh, no thanks on that and it's already downloaded I'll go back to your download files and it's right here but the thing is as you're trying to open it this little thing will pop up it says you need to be running a Windows 98 Millennium Edition or 2000 or maybe it might work on Windows 7 too. But I have that problem too. But I figured it out. So basically to open up that application so you can open up this one. You need to go to your control panel. You can either just go to the corner and right click to go to your control panel. Or you ha if you have this little funny flag, just go to your action center, just click control panel right here. And then you go to your, uh, let's 
see. Yeah. You go to your programs, and you see programs and features. You see this little thing right here? Run programs made for previous versions of Windows. You click that right ahead. Just go to next. And it's gonna detect the issues. But the thing is, it won't be listed though. So you gotta go to not listed. Go to next. Browse through to your downloads or wherever you keep your downloaded your DX web setup open shows right here go to next and try go to try recommended settings that's what I did last time and it tells you right here you can just test the programs do everything for me I'm not gonna do it I already done that but the thing is in order for you to do this, to open it up, you need to be connected to the internet. Sorry for people who don't have the internet or something like that. But then again, how you're reaching here in the first place. You just click test the program. It's gonna take you like around a good five minutes. That's how long it took me, because nah. Because it needs to update the program too. And once that finished, just press next and just press I think there's another DAX and you just close down the program, the troubleshooter program. And after you've done all that, let me see if this works. Because I downloaded the other thing. Now, after you finish doing that, go to your folder where you downloaded after you extracted it. Go to here, run administrator or open if you want, whatever works better for you. And boom, you have yours all ready to go, and your models that came with it, just like I showed you earlier. Nice, isn't it? All right. If you have any more questions, just feel free to ask and see what I can do or anything. And don't worry, I'll put up the links for you to go to these two to download the latest in each one and also downloaded that well if you have any more questions just leave a comment and good luck with your new programs